Well, they certainly like that. They was between those two little ones that we're going to try and get now. But saving swarms, probably the biggest one we've saved this year so far. And hopefully we'll get some more. Rest him on the uh, calf select and then you can move your fingers, there you go. On that? Yeah, rest him on it and now move it across so it's in the calf select. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah. So it can't squash the bees if I... Well, plus you can get your fingers out of the way. Right, oh, so yeah, now okay. move slowly move and don't brush everything off, just move away because these are hungry girls. Right, what we don't know is if the queen is on that frame, but it doesn't matter. Right. Okay, we're now putting everything on top. Look. <coughs> yeah, that's the way they go in. So of course I've got the wrong crown board because that won't fit on there. Me thinks this won't fit on here. Or will it? Yes, it will fit stuff. Yeah, look, they've started putting some on the branch. Yeah, wax. Right, hold on. This is funny, I can feel my gloves vibrating. Yeah. Okay, so, if you just, you got the video, if you just want to go back over there, that's it, move, move nice and slowly. Right, you see they're already starting to go in. Yeah, there's a couple. I tried to save as many as I could. You've done pretty well. This is a nice medium-sized swarm. <coughs> right, you see them running up now? Yeah. Look. This cardboard comes out. Yeah. Come up close, see? Come right up close, look at them. Get really up close. So could you potentially see the queen go up as well If then? she was on the frame, if not, when they first start, you suddenly see her running across the top of all of them. Ah, yeah. But she's probably in there on that frame if she's going to sense. That's a shame. Well, well it's I not a shame. It's a, long, it's a long shot, but look at that, eh? Isn't that just unbelievable? That is fantastic. <laughs> if you study, if you watch it for a while, you'll, you would have seen, because th these are just being a bit more receptive, probably because there's load in the box, but you would have seen some walking back down and chatting, and then they would all start off like this lot here. How do they know to walk up there? Oh, yeah, because... Somebody's yeah. told them. So is this thing like a queen excluder? No, no, I think that's just space. And, it, and an extra space. sort of bit you so might you can be able sit to put, You might be able to put a feeder in there or something, I'm not sure. No, absolutely. If it's from a swarm that obviously an apiarist keeps, they always mark them with the colours. So do you ever catch swarms where the queen's already marked? Yeah. And that tells you how old. But a lot of people, a lot queens. of amateur beekeepers won't mark them. Really? Can't find because the they're not, they're they're not into the genetics of that queen's a good layer, or it's in its third year. We need to replace it, stuff like that. You see, Just so it'll be a commercial beekeeper. And of course, the commercial beekeeper will manage this form. See all the bee. Oh, it's that. Yeah, that's out of the box. So what's that? Bee poo. Bee. Well, it could be wax. Because bear in mind they started to form wax on the. Uh, 
Yeah, it's been there since about eight o'clock this morning. Mm. But well, no, it'd be there all night. Well, it would have been there all night. I would have thought because it's 30 meters away from the other one. Yeah. Maybe it was that one that moved and yeah, the rain started done. last yeah. night. Yeah, absolutely. I don't know what oh, these. Oh look, look, they're up. Yeah, good stuff. I don't know what these guys are doing. Stop being confused. And get in. There you go. Move on up. Doodle, 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 doodle.